Uh, question number 8. Given that sine x plus 20 degrees is equal to minus 0 0.7660, find x to the nearest degree for 0 less than or equals to x less than or equals to 360. Now, uh, you get 3 marks. Uh, so if we are given that sine x is plus 20 is equals to minus 0 0.7666 If you use a unit circle, uh, let's, let's take a sample here uh, We divide into four parts Then we have uh, all trigger, we have act, that's what we call act We find that all the, in the second, first quadrant all, all trig ratios are positive Second quad uh, uh, quadrant, uh, only sine is ne positive. Third quadrant, uh, tan only tangent is positive. And fourth quadrant, only cosine is positive. So it means this angle here lies in this quadrant and in this quadrant because it is negative. So the first thing we need to do is to find what is the sine inverse of uh, 0. Uh, 7660 so that we'll be able to get uh, uh, these angles in the third and fourth quadrant. This angle here will give us 49.99 degrees so we say it is 50 degrees to the nearest uh, degree. <coughs> then from there is to get the angle equivalent to this in this in the third quadrant then we say uh, x plus 20 is equals to uh, this is uh, 180 degrees uh, plus 50 and it is also equals to in the third quadrant we, for the quadrant we get it is 360 minus 50 so that we get this angle here and uh, this angle will, which will represent the sign of uh, minus uh, because our our value here is minus so you find that x plus 20 is equal so when you add this uh, you get it is uh, 230 degrees uh, so you find x is equal to you take 20 to the other side so it is 230 uh, minus 20 and that will give you uh, 210 degrees the other one will say uh, that x plus 20 is equals to when you subtract here 360 minus 50 uh, you'll be able to get 310 so you take uh, 20 to the other side becomes negative so x is equals to 310 minus 20 and these are degrees uh, that means our x is equals to 290 uh, degrees so it means the values that to uh, satisfy x is equals to 210 uh, and 290. Why? Because if you had, if you add, uh, if you add 20, uh, 210, you add 20, uh, you get 230. When you get the sign of that, uh, 230, it will give you negative uh, 0 0.7660. 290 you add 20 it will be 310 when you get the sign of 310 you get it is equals to negative 0 0.7666 so the knowledge being tested here is uh, do you know how to get the trig ratios of angles uh, greater than 90 and we use a unit square to do that so because it's the one that tell us uh, which quadrant is a certain trig ratio is a positive is negative so we are able now to compare the angles in the first quadrant with the other angles of the other quadrant so that's how you do that question i hope you uh, you have followed if you haven't you can check from three topic uh, that is trigonometry two